This is our $12 million mansion project, baby. And we're gonna show you what we did to try to get it to that price and take it to the market. Since we're getting close to finishing this project up and sell this place, this is the stuff we've been working on. In the previous episode, we went to our warehouse to pick up the carpet for the elevator. Look at that, from the warehouse to the elevator. And uh, that carpet is really good carpet. We went out and we bought brass lever handles. So now even the garage has all matching handles. And then when the fuck, those shower doors have been on order for five months already. Yeah. I could have got those shower doors in two days at Home Depot. That's like a, it's the gold. All the gold's in China. It's brass plated. I hope these toilets scrub clean or I was gonna replace the door. See, I wanna see the guts inside. Okay, so let me tell you something. If the toilet's in good shape, you know, all you gotta do is replace the guts on the inside. Okay, it looks like he replaced the floater. That piece don't look new to the arm, but fuck it. For a fraction of the cost of placing the toilet, if you have to throw a new seat on it. All right, very good. Who's your fan that paid to call and talk to you about the fake grass? Can you tell Ben I'll do both putting greens, the one at Clearwater Beach Hotel and the other one for $14,396. That's a discount of $2,500. And how much we paid? 14 grand. There you go. So he, he blew it, you know? I take, that's why you take bids. Always get three bids. Always get the best price. The last guy claimed, oh yeah, I'm gonna beat everybody's prices. He didn't beat them. I think it's gonna look really cool on this uh, putting green going in. All right, a few days went by, and now we're gonna come and check on the driveway that's being painted. And we have Carla with us. Question is, this is brand new pavers here. To paint or not to paint to match that? You have to paint it to match it. You sure? Yes. If I, I would have done brown, I would not get black. I don't know why you did black, Ben. I would have been- Because the old one was black, you had to. Why are you screaming at me? He doesn't know his colors. You never want to paint any other color but this, with cars driving on it and all that. So we're gonna paint this so it matches. All those pavers were new, but they were the wrong color. These are new also, and we decided we're gonna paint these new pavers, and everything's gonna match, and everything's gonna be uniform and look right. We still got the landscaping to finish up. Let's go check on the putting green back there. Look at the lines look good. Tennis court looks good, the birds ain't shitting on it. I was excited to see the new putting green, but they fucked it up. They're putting a, a hole on the slope. I know, that was kind of weird. Why did he do it on the hill? I don't know. Hey, why did he do it right before the hill decline? A hole on the hill? Doesn't make a lot of sense. Ben, I'm gonna do a huge party before we sell it. Yeah, wow. what, no furniture? I don't, you don't need furniture to do a party. We just need tequila, we're good. We'll have the party when it sells. Now we have our special guest here, meet Kevin. Now, Kevin, you like to fix up houses, right? I love to fix up houses. Oh. All right, so you know, I figured, listen, <laughs> this guy he likes to fix up houses, he's doing all this stuff in California. I'm gonna show him what I do. You <laughs> met Kevin, <laughs> now meet Ben. Ah! This is how I flip a he house. one house, I get 60 for this. So that means I'm 60 times bigger than you, in reality, too. All right, so here we are. The owls are working. You know why they're working? Look around. You don't see no bird poop, baby. Buy those friggin' owls. How much were they on Amazon? 20 bucks. If you really want to go big time, you get the hunts with the bobblehead. That really scares them away. But these suckers are working. No bird shit, baby, because I hate bird shit. But I'll hang out with a bird. Oh, all right, let's see this dump. Seriously, yeah. if you got some good ideas, Throw them out there. Okay. If we don't like them, we'll say, fuck that. This area is gonna be all cleaned up. This is a barbecue area. We just put new granite in, new sink, new faucets. Matt bought the wrong grill. Okay, but you know what? You're a painter, you gotta talk to them, okay? Listen, you take the cap down off the ceiling fan before you paint, okay? Otherwise, you get that crap. Honestly, I think the cap may go high, but anyway, take a picture of that, because he's right, he's 100% right. Take a picture of that and send it to Ray Mannix, okay? You know why? He's collected a check from my office today. He only has to do the easy stuff. He's just walking around going, I, I put new paint, I, I did new paint, I painted this, I painted that. You didn't I, have to do it. I here. picked these lights out of. Well, I didn't get to see it. You still have a rusty vent up there. You don't want to show me the rusty vent? I haven't done the nitpicking yet. <laughs> well, you're paying this painter all the money. You got a rusty vent you're trying to sell. Yeah, I mean, the clean, we need that clean. So, uh, why didn't you glaze this? Well, this is like 90s paint tile. It's boring. Glaze it. Yeah, epoxy. We do it in our apartments. It's great. And guess what happens? The grout lines disappear too. It's really good. You know, what's going to happen is this. I like a lot of cushion. If somebody comes in here and the wife goes, I don't like the bedroom in the pool area. Yeah. 
How much? Yeah. All right, 20 grand, done. Take it off the price. Yeah, or you spend $600 now and don't have that 20 grand conversation. What are you doing tomorrow? <laughs> I'm not painting this. <laughs> Put a nice shower head on. Come on, man. This is like 99 cents you got on. 99 cents? You got that at the dollar store. Put down new shower head. No, he's right. These are the things that are going to trick this house out. Like you don't have toilet bolts on this toilet. The, the, the bolt caps. This is the nitpicking stuff we need to do now because we did all the major work. Now we're going to get some finicky ass person like him in here that's going to tell us all the little details. Yeah, like, like the screws, Ben. They got to be straight. Screw you. <laughs> all right, get the fuck out of here now. Do you think they get, like, somebody get creative about that? I mean, it doesn't really matter. See, like, over there, at least it's fully mortared in. He's right. Tell your concrete guy, just have him see if he can fill in all the cracks. This is the first time we get to see the fountain. It was just installed, and it's done. Looks you paid done. for this? No, there was a big old crazy naked babies. Okay. We whacked that sucker, and then we just put something simple. It doesn't block the view, and, you know, it's calm. This is good. Well, I was getting worried you put these tiles no, in. No, no, these tiles have been here since 1990. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I got some extra if you want some. No, I don't. Are you a $12 million house buyer? I like small little homes. I want old rich money. That's what I want. Yeah, you I'm ain't not, it. I'm not it. I no. want them old. I'm also old. not buying it with this 90s kitchen. What are you doing, spending all that money wait on a Wait a second, wait a second. Don't you want, you don't get the whole concept here. That's the problem. I don't get the concept. This is a 90s house. This is somebody who loved the fucking 90s. All right? This is the 90s. You can buy a new house, you can buy an old house, but can you buy a preserved 90s house? I'm thinking of putting a fucking disco ball in there. That's 80s, and nobody wants the 90s. <laughs> what year were you born? 92. That explains it. <laughs> That's why you keep wanting to kick me out and get rid of me. I'm going for nostalgia. Let's keep it in the 90s, baby. The 90s were pretty good years, I think. I don't remember. What are you doing, man? Ben, right. you know what you could do here? But you haven't oh, done it. Or I could give a credit. Well, come on. Man. Oh, I don't like that kitchen. How much? 100 grand. Could you spend 100 grand and make this kitchen look really look nice? I can make this kitchen All look right, nice for four grand. I'll give them a hundred thousand dollar discount if they don't like the fucking see, kitchen. See, this is That's the, the way I do shit. Yeah, you throw away a hundred when you could spend four and keep the hundred. See, see this you is, got see, time for that shit. I'm time for that my shit. You're worried about the, the weeds headaches, outside. The materials, the fucking uh, the GCs or whatever, like the workers. I ain't got time for that shit. First, you always try to split it without doing the work. If you can, and still make a profit. If that doesn't work, then you could be right. Yeah. I might show this house 20 fucking times and nobody likes it because it's outdated. Then you know what I'm gonna say? Get in there and fucking date it up. But I'm gonna test the water first. The because first if I test the water, I get that fucking profit. I move on to the next deal. Maybe, but then you've ruined the, the first impression. Then people see, oh, it's back on the market. He just put a little more lipstick on it. It kills it. That's the market we're in. It kills it. The market's about to check. Look, Ben, here's what you do. All right, we'll take it. We'll relax a little bit, okay? Here's what you gotta do. Yeah, let's in this relax. Kitchen. Let's calm it's down. It's not much. There are a few things you could do that take it to the next level. But the first thing you gotta do, these are good cabinets. They're really good, very good cabinets, okay? But they look like shit. Because this is an old color Change that nobody, hardware. nobody wants these cabinets. So what are you gonna do? You're gonna paint them. You prime them with a wood non-sand primer, maybe a quick little rub down. Everybody likes a quick little rub down. And then you paint them. Probably if you're gonna keep this stone, you go white. Or you change this to like a sparkly white quartz and you paint them gray. And now you've got a modern 2020s kitchen. What you're probably the, you're gonna, about the hardware. Well, the, all that gold shit's got to go. I mean, I, that was understood. Gold is coming back. No, you not, see the price of gold? <laughs> no, it's been flat. Uh, and this, this, <laughs> <laughs> this is not the kind of gold people want. I'm just shocked. You are spending so much money outside, and you didn't do the kitchen. <laughs> and yet, sure, your sure. your reference is, oh, we want the woman to be happy. And yet, you drop the ball here, man. How do you know it's not two rich men? It could be. You never know. Let them keep bitching. New faucet, baby. Look at that, it has a gun, so look at that. That is the right color. But who installed this? Tell Neil Titan Forcer. Oh, Ben, did you know the lesson on these? The what? You don't use this to open and close it? You know, what do you do? You, you take, it. yeah, you finger it like this. Yeah, you like to finger stuff. Yeah. I knew yeah. you were weird. But you know why? This is nice. I mean, did you put in all these can lights? I changed out every light in this house to more modern round yeah, lights. To the be little LEDs. LEDs and that, good, yeah. I mean, that's cheap because it's, you know, 120 bucks. Who are you calling cheap? Six the plan was, Tony, my, 
advisor, decorator. You want to come in here, you want to change, get all the gold out, off the doors, off the showers, yeah, off everything, he's right. change all these lights out. He's right. He wanted to go to town, and then he handed me the, the fucking estimate. I said, let's try it without it. it. No, it's big money these days. For good lighting and good hardware, you can't go quick set in a fucking million dollar mansion. Yeah, you can. one of your rentals. <laughs> Fine. Sure. Even I know that, and I like or, to go cheap. Or, uh, I don't know, what's the other expensive one? I don't know the expensive Whatever. one. Whatever. So but spend 50 it was, bucks. No, no, it was hundreds of thousands of dollars. Every, you know how many lights and doorknobs are in this fucking house and hinges? The list was enormous. It was hundreds, I'm telling you, he gets the cheapest shit around. There's okay, so it's about six 2,000 square foot homes. My electrical budget for this would be 30 grand. The lights, these lights, and the hardware, 30 grand. And that's a lot. That's a lot. I beg to differ. I will save money on that. Something that, in my opinion, would bring this, this to 20 gonna... I'm trying to tell you shit! The, the crown molding's beautiful, but it's the wrong color. It needs to be ultra pure white. Because what they did is they painted it almost to blend in with the wall. You're losing the contrast, that sparkle you could have. Even look at the baseboard. See how much more of a baseboard contrast you have between the wall and the base? It, it better than this, because here the crown disappears. You don't even see the crown, because there's no contrast. Paint it! You're worried about a hundred grand on light fixtures and stuff, which is a ripoff anyway. When you could be doing little things like this. Cracking, what is this crap? Paint and caulk. I write these down so I don't have to worry about nitpicking myself. He's doing it for me. So I'm getting a free inspection here. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. This is antique. It's garbage. It's gotta go. <laughs> I'm gonna call one of your grandparents up and tell them you called old garbage. Okay, this is nice. You guys painted that up there. Yeah, we painted yeah, the accent. Good. We like accent. Yeah, yeah. I need a bigger light fixture. I couldn't find one. No, don't worry about it. That's fine. Big, I want big. Nobody's gonna notice that. Nobody. When they come if up they and show down this house, another couple of feet from the street, a big beautiful fixture, they're gonna notice it. That's what you wanna spend money on and not the kitchen. Because that's the, the first thing is first impression. Bam, in your face, big yeah. giant fancy lights. And then lights. They, they click to the kitchen and they're like, nah, next ah. house, that's a fixer upper. Because what are they going to do? Come and go, it's going to cost a This is a rich woman that's going to come in and decorate the way she wants, but it's going to be an old lady. Decorate is not rip out the kitchen and remodel. No, 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 rip out the kitchen. That's what my wife said. She said the same fucking thing. She wanted to make it big and rip it out and do this and that. Oh man cave. This is a man's room. Okay. Stop you, opening the blinds, you're letting the sun in. Yeah, you're you're. And that means I have to run the AC. That's gonna cost an extra $25 a month. Ooh, look at look that. Look at your Maybe. windows getting wrecked. Don't, See, that, this. You're not supposed to open these. Yeah, is I this know. permanently stained? No, this this is done. This one All right, done. new glass, big no, deal. No, 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 no. You know what you do? What? You don't do this now. You do that in the inspection. You do the kitchen now, and when they come bitch, because I guarantee you they will, that they want 30 new windows in this house for 30 grand, that's when you give it to them and then you close the deal. Duly noted. <laughs> oh man. I, I mean, you could rip this wallpaper down, paint this, you know, white, simple, modernize this. Yeah, how much it cost to rip wallpaper down? Uh, well, I pay my guy Timo like 12 bucks an hour. All right, send him over. You got somebody work for 12 bucks down California, you're a liar. Yeah, you're right, he's 25 bucks an hour. <laughs> but he only works half as hard, so he gives him half pay. Send him over, put him on a plane, I'll send a plane for him, how about that? And the mirror is crooked. Do you, you guys have levels in Florida? Yeah, we're kind of weird. We don't see straight. Oh, my guy's got one fucking crooked eye I forgot that does all my work. In case of emergency. Oh, God. Here we go, baby. You didn't even replace the rugs. No, this carpet's in great shape, are you kidding me? I'm gonna clean this, this is expensive carpet. You know what this is? You see this, this right here? This, this, this is... That's right. 27,000 different times. No, the okay. wheelchair was here, and there's the wheel in the wheelchair. Whatever! You have two masters here. The husband master and the wife master. Who's the master in your house? You like bows, don't you? Compact This was the first Bose What is this? CDs. I don't know what that is. What is this? You don't device? know what a CD is? I, I, I don't know what this is. <laughs> it works. The wall paint sucks, man. It's just, it's the crown. It's pink, dude. The crown molding's pink. My wife bought those lights. Yeah, all right. You went back to the 90s. Cause I'm a 90s bitch. No, you're like a 30s bitch. <laughs> he hates this house. <laughs> I love it. Because he's, you know, a young millennial from California. We don't like nothing old. We want everything new. We want the newest cars. We want the newest technology. We want new, 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 new. This is what you guys spent money on? This happens to be part of the decor. 
That the, was here already. This is your staging. You, you That's put, not staging. You put care. three boxes in a $12 million house and you <laughs> staged it. In a closet. In a closet, you <laughs> asshole. <laughs> you have so little shame you even label it empty. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. Look at that. Furnished wet bar. Microwave fridge. Drinking water. Come on. I just put these in. These weren't here. This is empty. Oh, I put the shower glass in. You put gold. I had to match the gold because otherwise I'd change all the fucking fixtures. That's what I'm saying. I can't believe it. And you didn't even do the new brass. You did the old brass. Because we had to match the old brass. What the hell is this? <laughs> you want your clothes? You call your clothes. You know what the problem with this is? It would encourage my wife to spend more money. I All right, turn it off before it breaks down. You want to buy it? Make me an offer. I'll tell you what. I'm going to sell this pig for $12 million when I finish it. I'll sell it to you right now, as is, for 11 4.2. <laughs> Maybe I'll give you the tennis court for that. Here, look at that, baby. You can't even replace this the is smoke detector. Preservation. Who's, who's gonna, yeah, you're preserving the smoke detectors. No smoking in the house. From the 90s. Even I don't smoke in this house, barely. Hidden fan, new Chinese technology. Oh my gosh, it's Come tiny. from Fan Yu. Why? Why? This should be, the blade should be twice as long, Ben. You guys undersized it. Look at it, hidden fan, baby. You ain't got one. And I don't want it. Well, first of all, it's too dark in here. You have a cornucopia light fixture. Literally. What the fuck's a cornucopia? That. A food horn. The closet's two or three times as bright as the bathroom. Look, this, this is happy. This is happy. Look, see? Smile. When you look like me, you don't want a lot of light in the bathroom. <laughs> the gym. Okay, all right. Why did they do this? They screwed it up. This is the, the cheaper vinyl plank, right? This is a nice hardwood floor. So they wanted to save 120 square feet, and now you got the dumb transition, and then you're going to cheap. It's literally, you're showing expensive, cheap. Expensive, cheap. They effed up. I didn't do it. See, that is an appropriately sized ceiling fan. I bought camera. that and picked it out, did I not, in Home Depot. Why don't you get your ass in the fucking sauna so we can test it? All get right. in the sauna. <laughs> Put him in there. Give me the fucking padlock. Let's lock him in the fucking sauna. You want to come to my house? And we're going to turn that sucker all the way up. We're going to cook Kevin. He'll be meat cook Kevin when I get done with him. Honestly, because I give credit when it's due. I value his opinion. He has a lot of experience in houses. He came in here. He nitpicked the shit out of the goddamn house. He's got me over here. He needs a little paint over here. He wanted me to paint all this shit. All right, a lot of his things were very important. I'm going to take into consideration. A lot of other things he wants me to go out and spend a bunch of money on, I ain't doing. Why? Because I'm going to test the market. I like to test the water, see how warm it is. If the water's warm, I'm going to sell this puppy. If it's cold, I'm going to come in and do what he said to do. And I don't blame you for that because I think we're heading into a little bit of the cliff of the market. If you can dump it now the way it is, I don't blame you for doing it. I'd probably test it too. Test the water. And you never know because you said you, you bought this end of last year? You didn't pee in my pool yesterday, did you? Oh no, I would never Come on, that. please. I don't know where that pee is in that pee. Don't pee in my pool, please. Oh, okay. I'll make sure to do that today. No, don't do number two either. I'll kill you. <laughs> if you walked into this project today, yeah. today, what would be your budget? Excluding the pool, because I think you've already got that done. 30 grand. Cuckoo. Oh. Recession, baby. Everything's four times the price right now. Inflation. And then the labor. You mean inflation. You mean inflation. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Strong for a little bastard. Okay, he wait. says 30. I say five times that. Hit the like button, even if you don't like Kevin. I'm going to take a lot of shit into consideration, and there we go. Now we're off to the next stop. Oh, shit. We're in trouble now, baby. Now we're gonna find out how good of an assistant Matt really is. We're gonna find out. He's got a lot riding on this. It was my fault, because I left without a fresh pack. Whoa! Matt's got emergency cigarette stash. So did I leave him there? I probably leave him there. That's a big bottle. You guys better drink that motherfucker if you open it, I'll tell you right now. All right, well go outside. Don't fucking shoot the cork and fuck my stars up. I lost about 100 grand a year in rental income. Now, we're gonna rent it out for 100 and a quarter, I think. So, actually, by the tenant moving out, 
you know, all right, we had to give them some free rent for them to do a build out. But now in the future, we're going to have a hundred a quarter a year coming in. So that's going to increase the value of the property because our cap rate just went up. What does she want? Well, my boss has a Phantom Rolls Royce. He's got a black one. Do you like 90s kitchens or prefer modern kitchens? Modern. Good, okay. Scale of one to 10, the plaza. Two, three? Uh, five. five. Okay. Listen, lady, the only reason why you're even driving through here is because it's a shortcut to the fucking trailer park behind my shopping center. Look, she's turning there, she's turning there, and she's going right in a fucking trailer. Take your ass off my property. Come drive through my property, you don't even fucking buy anything. After the plaza, we went to John's Pass. We brought a new attraction to John's Pass, the trolley boat, baby. But of course, the guy that runs all the boats over there, he wasn't too happy. I got my big truck. I'm Captain Hubbard. I got a big truck. I drive in the water. I fish off my truck. Did you steal the time frames for your new stupid duck boat right from my website or from my brochure? You know. And by the way, if you're gonna run boat tours, why the hell would you get a duck boat? You know how many things those people killed in the last year? And are you gonna ask? This is what you call a hater. But he doesn't realize competition breeds business for everybody. Are we fishing on the fucking boat? No. Does, it, does his boats go on the road? No. You're the, blocking the, traffic, mister. Call a cop. Problem. Get him arrested. The, Get him out of here. A hater. A hater. You stole my tour time, you son of a bitch. I need to do Fucking hater. All right, we met Kevin here a few weeks ago. And now we're back, we're making improvements. Let's take a look and see what we got done. Look at the pool. Ready to go, baby, brand new. He said, why don't you take all the crown molding and highlight it and give it a nice white accent color. So we did, and he was right. So here we are, we had the painter come in, he accented all the crown molding in every room and it kind of made it pop. Now we have a formal dining room with an accent. Listen. If you got a deal, or you're thinking about buying or selling something, you need to go to Consult with Ben. BenMaller.com slash shop, Consult with Ben. Get me on the phone. Who the heck else do you know that's done all the real estate I've done that you can get on the phone and get pure, honest advice from? There's a lot of fake accounts out there and imposters. Do not send any money of anything under my name unless you go to BenMaller.com and go talk to Rafal if you want a consultation. I don't take crypto, I don't take investors, I don't take nothing. Check out me Kevin's channel. He made some videos with me. Subscribe, watch another video, hit the like button, and leave a comment. Why? Because I read them. Adios, amigos.